Hierarchical file systems mirror how people organize data in the real world. However, this method relies on the user to organize their files. If documents are misfiled, badly named, or mismanaged, the system becomes unwieldy. Chronosphere is a time and content-based navigational interface for computer media. Files are arranged by their modification dates. Clicking on a file centers the view on the time when the file was created, and more files appear as the viewport changes. Users can scroll with their mouse to zoom into any particular time period and navigate backward and forward in time to see the temporal context of their work. Since projects often spend finite amounts of time, files that appear in close temporal proximity are often related. Chronosphere naturally visualizes clusters of these temporal relationships. For example, images in movies that were taken at roughly the same time are likely to have been taken at the same place. Let's say I want to search for work relating to WIST. Chronosphere zooms into last week and shows documents whose names or keywords contain the word WIST. If I remove my query, I can see that at the same time I was working on an image, a diagram for my WIST submission. I can also right-click on a file and see its entire history. Each time a file is modified, it is considered to be a new entity on the timeline. Thus, the timeline serves as an unobtrusive versioning system. If I look at the associated keywords, I can see how my document evolved over time without having to open it. The system uses TFIDF and text analytics to extract significant keywords and phrases from text documents. These keywords are displayed next to each document on the timeline. Similarly, images are tagged with their predominant colors and songs are tagged with the artist and title information. Users can also add new tags or modify existing tags. This metadata enables users to quickly grasp the content of their files while browsing the timeline. I can also search for a particular file type. My audio collection shows a cluster of Bell and Sebastian songs. I can click on it to center, and then zoom in to that day. I see that some songs are tagged with the album Tiger Milk. If I click on this keyword, and then zoom out, I can see all songs from this album. Chronosphere relies on rapid content-based image search to extract features from images and determine their relationships based on content. Suppose I want to find other photographs that are similar to this one I took in Chile. I can right-click and select Show Similar Images. The timeline shows a set of photographs that look like the one I selected. I can navigate through them and retrace my journey as I photograph the same place from different angles and distances at different points in time.